welcome Hi. to our long let's play. Oh yeah. I it's hope your it's, long. it's your favorite game. Can this, I say that? This is my absolute favorite game, yes. Life is strange. And how strange it is sometimes. Yes, it is. Even real life. I never thought I would play this again live with you guys, but gladly he hasn't seen or played anything yet. This is like Game of Thrones for me, Ooh. that you haven't seen this yet. I mean, you know, not a lot of people have seen this because, I mean... Yeah. It's, it's, yeah. it's just a game it's after just, all. I don't know. It's For me, it's just like... It's an experience that you have to make. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, I mean, I played it on my, my gaming channel. Yeah. God, I was, I was like the most emotional I ever was in my life. Um, about everything, about anger. You know, stuff I've never felt before in a game. That started like the whole thing with adventure games for me. And uh, now I'm glad that you're playing. Yeah. I don't know how your reaction will be. Maybe I have no idea. It. Yeah, maybe. Um, I doubt it, but... Yeah. You know, I the only adventure, like... Um, first of all, this is a game where you have to choose things. Yeah. You know, their choices matter in this game. Um, and the only game that I played in that style is The Walking Dead. Yeah. Season 1. That's yeah. it. Um, this is a game like that. Of course, the setting is also important. This is a real life setting, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't. I don't believe it or not. I have no idea what it's about. If it's about, you know, I mean, real life means a lot of things. You know. Yeah. I don't know the characters. I don't know the story. I don't know anything. I love that. And I keep that extra like that because I want to let's play these things. Yeah. So I I don't spoil myself at all. So. Oh yeah. Yeah, here we are and also I am I'm so excited. You guys will see me cry and and scream and everything again. So don't worry my my, my I reaction. like it already. My reactions will be I love the it already. same. Oh man. <laughs> okay, I'm going to press a button, yeah. any button. Uh, we tried that out just a second ago. Uh, if everything was working, the recording and all. I'm going to delete that. I'm going to start a new s game. Yeah, do it. Are you are you are you are you excited? Are you ready? I I I I'm not sure. I'd say so. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to get your expectations too high because this You're, is um, a very you know detail game of game about details and okay. stuff. So um, it could happen that we play two hours. It could be three yeah. hours. It yeah. Could be, oh yeah. You, you know. Please be patient. Uh, yeah. Uh, We're uh, gonna. First of all, we're trying to take everything from the game. Um, he know, you know it everything, right? I know everything. Um, and I'm a person who plays like very slow because I look at everything. Thank you. If there is Me something too. to look at, I will look at it. Even though it's mostly probably unimportant. Yeah. I will do it. Me too. Be patient. Uh, and backseat gaming, of course, please. <sighs> it's not necessary. I love the music. It's man. not necessary. I, our faces at the beginning. I will put that in. Okay. I was just... Ah, new game. That's good. Yeah. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Past? That's what it says. But what do you say? <laughs> <laughs> That's the question. I jumped... Uh, I got scared yeah. on that before. I always get scared with that. <laughs> always. Ooh, how it vibrates, dude. I mean, the gamepad. Don't. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Already. Where am I? What's happening? So the first thing that you notice is that you get to know I am what's inside the people's heads. Okay. You know, their thoughts, you know, her thoughts. Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, she wasn't talking. Yeah. She was just thinking it out exactly. loud. Exactly. Um, okay, to the lighthouse. <clears throat> of course, I'm not going to go to the lighthouse. Never, never. <clears throat> I don't know. Okay, so we're this lovely lady. Yes. 
Uh, forever. So this Maybe. is the ma okay. Her name is Max. I mean, I can tell Max. you. Max. Yeah. Spoiler alert. We didn't get to that point yet. Okay, I can't go anywhere. Good. Can I run? Can I do anything? Lighthouse. You can't run? No. Nothing? And I can't hide? Not sure. <laughs> Where do you want to hide? <laughs> For the storm, that is um, okay. Okay, so let's go to the lighthouse. Yeah. Maybe it will shed some light on these very dark... It's really dark, my yeah. god. Um, ooh! Uh, oh, that's a lighthouse. You can make it. Now we got the name. Uh, oh, I can walk faster. Okay. Blackwell, ninth Blackwell ceremony. Blackwell Academy. Academy, yeah. Nineteen ten. Ooh, look at that. Map that of the, symbol of the town, I guess. Yeah. And Academy, so school or college or something. Holy <laughs> shit! Okay. I love the art style in this. This is honestly. very, very, very weird. I'm guessing this has to be a nightmare, right? I'm in a dream. We're in a dream. It looks real to me. It doesn't make sense. Maybe she was tricked by her... Jesus. By her friends. You will hang out here? Uh, yeah, hold on. I'm gonna sit on the... Let's see. gonna be a lot of swearing in the game and with us. Always. Whoa. Already dead. That was so that. surreal. Called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to to Kiroskiro. Now, can That's you wrong. give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't already fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. You know, already hate these two. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. I love it. That's great, right? I love it. This is so well done. Mm. So well shot. Uh, photography class. Uh, hold on, first of all. Yeah, we can we can um, talk about it. Now it's it's paused. It was obviously a dream. It was, yeah. She slept right in front of the teacher. <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, very nice. Yeah. You gotta be very tired to yeah. sleep in class, so. She has a, ooh, she has a very, very life. I hate that yeah, word. Yeah. You know, you can always like, I think it was something like that. Okay, okay. I okay, can. so, yeah. We're now in class and listening to a lecture. Yeah. Uh, and these two probably uh, don't give a shit. either art, photography, or maybe something like that. Yeah, it's because I mean this is it's photography. Yeah, I mean he said it. I think he said it. Yeah. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and um, children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? I can't believe I it's still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. That's oh, you should. But I like it old school. Yeah. yeah. Any one of you in a dark corner and capture you. Should I listen or should I look? And any one of you could do that to me. <laughs> Isn't that too easy? I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? If anybody else looked at this, what that's would a lot to read. I'm not sure if we should do that, or if we just skip, you know, through we're reading it ourselves. Um, also, that's the story. Yeah, that's that's pretty her much. diary. Or, yeah. Her okay. Dog. Okay. There are characters in there. There are his her story. As you proceed, um, new pages will be added, and you get to see what she thinks of all that, you know? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. And those are things you can those play are again? Those are chapters. Or? Okay. Those are chapters. Within the episode. Yeah, exactly. Okay, 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 okay. Episode, okay. That's the episodes. There are places, I think? Yeah, like what kind of... Where you are in the episode. Okay. And that's, yeah, your phone. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're She's an adult 18, now, yeah. but you're still our little girl. Check your account. Ooh, don't blow it all at once on cocaine, of course. Yeah. Um, Cage. Uh, hey Max, you around? Always. You okay? Do you want to go to do get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. T T Y L. Talk to you later. 
Okay, thank you. I didn't know that. Happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. XO. Warren? Who is Warren? Is it a bad boyfriend? <laughs> Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study. Please. <laughs> no answer at all. Make sure you check out Necromantic on my flash drive. <laughs> hey, Mad Max. <laughs> let's wash it up. I like this dude. Wait, I have to study for a physics test, so if you bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. Please, don't ignore this message. Yeah, this dude. what are you doing? He's like a funny dude. Yeah, I mean, you can already tell what he is. Kinda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He likes her, and she not so much, or she um, doesn't know, or she, you know, from just, you know, just from the text. It's awesome. Yeah, you can, we can, we could read the character files, I think. Oh, is there but more? There are character files from like the characters we already met. Okay. And the, then there's a diary, which is eight. That's the story before all this happened. How did I get to that though? Hold on. Of their beauty or anything. If anybody Hold on. else looked at this, what would they think? Yeah, exactly. Eight. So we yeah, just go back to the first. Oh, that's this, the prologue. Yeah. We can, Holy that's a lot. Shit. We can read it by ourselves. Yeah. And, uh, you know. Just skip it. Is or... it is it important for the story? Not really. You Not you really. can most of it you uh, get, get the while yeah, you yeah, okay. enter the game, but some things you don't. Okay. B b because that's it's, seriously it's, it's a, a lot. lot. Yeah, it's a lot. You don't have to. I mean, like I like I to read these things. This is really cool. Yeah, yeah. Things like this, but man, the other thing is a bit exaggerated. Okay. Okay. I mean, we said we, we will take time. Okay, right. We said that it will take a long time. Yeah, sure. So um, I would I wouldn't mind to read all this. No, honestly. oh, shit. oh really? sorry. Uh, yeah, me neither. Honestly, um, we okay. could. You want page after page? We could. Yeah. Really? <laughs> okay. So this first episode is gonna be a little little longer, I guess. Then. Yeah. Um, let's see what how we'll do it in the next episodes yeah. of Life is Strange. But no, this is the most you ever read. Okay. The, the other things we won't read because it's just what happened. It's like a recap yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So this is the only thing. Ah, that, okay. okay. I get it. Okay. July 10, 2013. Yeah, I'm going to start. I got accepted into Blackwell Academy. If words could dance, this would be a rave. Even though I've never been to one. But who cares because I got into Blackwell Academy. I didn't think I would be so excited since it's not like I didn't used to live in the same town. But when I saw the text from the Blackwell Scholarship Office, I could literally feel, feel my pulse speed up. So she was living in this town yeah. before. I thought it was going to say, sorry, thanks for playing. It took me a few seconds before I read the whole thing. I guess I wanted to enjoy that last moment of blissful ignorance. And when I saw the first word, congratulations, I think I screamed. My mom cried and my dad laughed. They are so weird, but they're happy. And this means extra financial support because they don't have to pay anything to Blackwell. This means new clothes, and I can work it, a new laptop, and if I can work it. Oh, and I have to keep telling myself in caps that I'm going to Blackwell Academy. So she got accepted into this academy. That's very sweet, by the way. Yeah. I love her diary. It's so cool. Like, the, the sketches and everything. Yeah. It's so cool. She's a true artist. Yeah. August 18, 2013. So this is it. I'm leaving Seattle to go back to Arcadia Bay. Usually people go to the high school closet to home. Closest to home, sorry. <laughs> I suppose I am too, it's just I haven't lived there for five years. Out of, out of all the best photography programs in the world, I choose to go to the smallest, back in a town I was excited about leaving. Maybe I want to come back all along just to see if Chloe and I are still even friends. But I do wish Chloe could have moved with us to Seattle. That city was made for her. When we would play pirates in our rooms and in the woods, it seemed like Seattle was that fabled fairway island of treasure and adventure that we were always seeking. With coffee shops. Arr. <laughs> but Seattle wasn't like a fable, or contraire. Uh, now Blackwell Academy seems more exotic to me than any other place in the world. To study photography under Mark Jefferson. <sighs> I mean, sigh. <laughs> sigh. Insert hearts and flowers. Plus there will be cool, diverse students from everywhere. It won't be like my high school now. I never really found a groove out with my classmates or boys. I'm lucky I have a couple great friends here, but it's time to ship out. Oh dear. dear. That's so good, man. <laughs> so maybe Arcadia, Arcadia, Arcadia Bay will actually turn out to be, I, to be the island of treasure and adventure I've been looking for yeah, so after all. 
she is leaving yeah. and she has a friend here named Chloe. Chloe. She's very, uh, you know, weird. Excited if they are Adventurous. friends. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Now she's coming back and she. Woohoo! We'll meet again. August 25, 25, 2013. You're always doing that. That's good. Shit is crazy here. I didn't realize how much crap I had to pack until I had to pack all my crap. Mom and dad are getting a little too excited. I'm clearing out my room. Though I caught mom crying when she was packing my shirts. That made me want to cry like a little girl. I never leave Seattle. So instead of packing, I feel like burning all my clothes and just raiding a thrift store to build up a new Max wardrobe over my junior year. Now that I even have an old Max wardrobe. Nobody will know me except for Chloe and who knows how different we are now. So I could cut my hair, get a tat, get some piercings, maybe date a cute foreign exchange artist from Paris or Rome. Of course. I can do anything unless I get busted. Busted. And there will be so, <clears throat> so many super cool chances for my photography to get exposed. Thinking about that is when I get scared but excited. And then I don't feel like crying at all. I get tingles down my arms, sensing the universe opening up for me. I can't wait to leave. The cat, man. Go, you. I just want things to be different at Blackwell. <laughs> okay. September 2, 2013, 12.07 a.m. <laughs> Even the time, dude. My first entry from my new dorm room the night before my first day at Blackwell. Whew, I haven't had any time to write or even take pictures since I got here. My shit is in boxes all over the room, which is small, but mine and I never want to leave. I can't wait to de I can't wait to decorate. I plan a whole wall of photos. I did meet some of my dorm mates, though I suck at remembering names. So yeah, I won't hi. bother right now. But I think I can already see who's going to be cool to me and who's not. It's a bitch trying to get settled into a new school and social scene after I finally found good friends in Seattle. But I'm here now, and this is the start of my new life. Sweet dreams, me. Sweet dreams. September 3, 2013. Blackwell sucks ass. Already. I told myself not to whine so soon, but damn. Day started like Christmas morning. I barely had any dreams because I was so pumped to start my first official day of my new life. Like a dork, I couldn't figure out what to wear, so I chose what was on the floor. I'm no good with names and faces right away, but I picked up some names, like Kate, Brooke, Taylor, Alyssa. And how, I c how could I forget Victoria Chase? Rich, stylish, entitled. I could feel instant judgment when she looked at my raggedy ass clothes. As if I'm at Blackwell to strike fashion poses. Maybe I'm being extra crispy sensitive, but I think Victoria wants life here to be like her own reality show. Ugh. Um. Where was it? What? Um. The day where she was pumped to start for a show yeah. day or something. You know, when something new happens to me, I'm like, okay. Yeah. I'm like keeping expectations low, so I can't be disappointed. Me too. Me too. It's, it's, I don't know, it's the yeah. style that I got over the years of life, I guess. Yeah, because, I mean, life always fucks you. Yeah. <laughs> Sooner or weird. later. Exactly. So, it's, so, you know, and the weird thing is, it sounds very pessimistic. Yeah, it does. But I'm a very optimistic person. But it's working, yeah. It's working. It's very weird. Um, and Kate Brooke Taylor, all this is probably one person, right? Yeah, exactly. That's <laughs> like, uh, So that was not fun along with my general social unease. I thought it would be easier being back. Call the wham <laughs> ambulance. <laughs> I don't want to stay tight. <laughs> Where is Max? It was <laughs> I love her so much. It was incredible to walk across the green campus in the morning mist. I love the stone steps and brick walls of Blackwell. Everything is a picture waiting to be taken. Speaking of, at least one great thing had to happen today. Mr. Jefferson's photography class. <sighs> Sigh. <laughs> There's more to tell, but journal, forgive me, I'm truly wiped out. Truly wiped out. Wambulance. Okay, um, wambulance. so... You know the wambulance? Max is great. Max is truly <laughs> great. Yeah, the September 4. I have an ass load of homework already. So much bullshit. At least give us noobs a day to acclimate. I agree. Yeah. But to prove I'm not a total loser, I made a new friend in my science class. His name is Warren Graham. Ooh. And he's a serious geek, plus he's dark and witty. Nice. He, came, he comes across <laughs> as a kind of a know-it-all, but it turns out he does kind of know a lot. We talked about photographers, and he actually named a few I'd never heard of. We traded numbers, and he'll be a good study partner, or a good friend. Ooh, not, but not a boyfriend or anything. No. no speak of that. Maybe she doesn't think of him of him like that yeah, yet. Maybe her self-confidence. 
somehow, and she yeah. thinks, oh, he's never interested. I mean, she he's mentioned twice like, once. So, like, yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. I'll need at least one based on the click action here. I thought being 18 men, I didn't have to deal with these teenage drama anymore. I thought. At least I get to research famous photographers for some of my homework. Mr. Jefferson assigned us a ton of reading, but this is exactly what, what I want to study. Jefferson is a super cool and super chill. I can tell you, you, you were sleeping yeah. in front of him. Yeah. You didn't mind. I, you know, I love teachers like that, honestly. Yeah. Like Just keeping it relaxed. Yeah. And just She will fail at she, the end, yeah, you exactly, know? Exactly, exactly. Just do your stuff. Yeah. Be nice, and that's it. Exactly. Don't have to force anything. Yeah. He doesn't try to be too hip. He, he just says what he thinks and expects us to all as well. I think he's a genius. OMG, I want to marry him. <laughs> just joking. This one class is worth <laughs> all the social dysfunction. Bit, okay, thank you. That's how it has to be done, you know. I to marry him. <laughs> September 15. Homework is kicking my ass. I bet the teacher's grade harder to s just stop you from feeling special. But Victoria Chase and his snob minions still front like they're honored guests of Blackwell. The bros here aren't that different. Nathan Prescott is a victorious male clone with way more money and attitude, if that's possible. His family is the oldest in Arcadia Bay, and I heard stories about them when I was a kid. Prescott's give a shitload of bang to Blackwell, so Nathan acts like he literally owns the school. Yesterday during class, he put his feet on the desk, started texting, and the teacher didn't say Jack. I'd get suspended. But him and Victoria are part of the silly elite vortex club that puts on popular parties and so they get their way. It's good to be the king and queen. I don't want to slam everybody. I do like Kate Marsh. She's down the hall in one of my classes. She's so pretty and sweet and friendly. It makes her more beautiful than the bitches here, like Victoria, who think beauty is just your face and outfit. See, I'm already playing their drama games. No more. Hopefully, but I agree it, will, uh, it won't yeah. go that direction. No. September 23. Finally had a chance to take some actual shots around the campus today. A perfect blue sky. I always forget how great I feel after I take pictures when I've been slacking off. What? I feel so relaxed with the music, honestly. Yeah. This is amazing. I hope you don't sleep, fall asleep, but if you do, it's like a podcast. It's the perfect, but, uh, honestly, yeah. What happened before yeah. all that? <laughs> Speaking of pictures, Mr. Jefferson told us about the National Everyday Heroes photo contest he wants us all to enter. The winner gets a trip to San Francisco and lots of publicity. He just he wants just one photograph from each student. This is exactly why I want to come to Blackwell, and of course, I'm scared shitless to enter. At least I have a couple of weeks before the deadline in October, so I have plenty of time to stress and procrastinate. Sigh. Sigh. September 30. I don't know whether I love it or hate it here. I'm trying to keep up with my science class of all things. Like I give a shit or even understand it. Good thing I know Warren. Too bad I can't clone him to take my place in class. Miss Grant is much cooler than the class. She explains particle physics so even boneheads like me can kind of understand. I love how she relates society to science and vice versa. I can tell she committed and passionate about, her, about life. Unlike some of us in her class, but I'm trying to engage more, even if it means asking actual questions in class instead of hiding in the back. I'm just glad I'm not the only s social misfit here. Now, how much homework are you avoiding? <laughs> I like it though. She yeah. like actually participates even though it's not her thing. I yeah. like I love that. I'm it's thinking cool. right now if I did that. No. Partly. I didn't. I mean I didn't. In very few classes, really. Yeah, yeah. October one. October, my favorite month, the best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. But it's still too damn hot, thanks global warming. And I can't pass out of the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet. Soon. Kate let me borrow The October Country by Ray Bradbury. I haven't read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek cred before I held up my copy of Battle Royale, but he nails the autumn atmosphere of small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. Ooh, maybe we'll see it. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. Is that or a Vortex Club stroke or swimming party, or is that bro... Backstroke fest, you're so punny, Max. <laughs> At least I'm trying to climb out of my cuckoo, and I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy, as my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. Yeah. And then you're dead. Yeah, that's what always, what people always try to tell you, and then, after like two or three years, you don't have time anymore. You have to do everything. Yeah. You're responsible for every shit. Exactly. <laughs> well, that was it. Page eight. <clears throat> Um, that's it? Yeah, that's it. Oh, really? Wow. We're done. Okay, wow. That's cool. Uh, so, we still got characters. Characters. Four people yet. Kate was the 
cool person. Jefferson is, of course, the super relaxed prof. And Victoria is that bitch. The bitch. The bitch. Exactly. Um, okay. okay, we already that the messages yeah. are, actually. Yeah, we don't... Yeah, exactly. Do we need that? I think... Oh, yeah. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. My name is Mac Caulfield. No, I'm not going to read that. Please like don't. That. And ever since I was a little kid, I knew I wanted to be a photographer. I've always seen the world through my own lens finder. Maybe it's a way for me to be part of the world, but at a safe distance. For some reason, I always was drawn to old analog camera gear rather than digital tech. I love all kinds of styles and techniques, but for me, the instant camera selfie is the one I love most. I don't care if people make fun of me or not. I'm in great company, right? And now I've come all the way to the, my childhood home to study photography at Blackwell Academy, a private school for 12th grade or seniors. On a scholarship even, I originally left behind Chloe, my best friend forever, at least until I left without taking her once in five, without talking to her once in five years. And it feels so weird to be back here without seeing her yet. So I'm 18 now, an official adult, even though I don't always feel so wise or mature. And I'm ready to begin a whole new life here with a retro camera at my side. Say cheese. Man. What? I don't know. I can I kind of can relate to things. Yeah. That's weird. You Yeah, you will see that a lot. I love it. Ooh. Not only is Mark Jefferson one of the best photographers in the world, he's also my teacher. And one of the reasons I want to come to Blackwell. How often do you get to be mentored by one of your inspirations? I've always loved this deco and goth style and he's so versatile with all of his incredible print and advertising work. Still, Jefferson can be a bit condescending. He's a pretty hip for his age, but kinda aloof and sometimes pretentious. He has this smug smile when he thinks he's right. But I do think he's preparing us for how tough it is to be a full-time artist. He acts like he understands my own work and obsession with analog images. He really wants me to enter a photo in this everyday heroes contest, but I've done a good job of avoiding that. The winner gets to fly to San Francisco to represent Blackwell Academy and get national exposure. Exposure. I'd like to think my work could be good enough to win and I'm honored Jefferson even bugs me about the contest. Still seems to be a cool dude. Yeah. I guess. I've forgotten if i ever seen Kate Smart smile alive in the past month. She's really sweet and nice, even though the other students make fun of her abstinence campaign. Even if they act immature, everybody at Blackwell are seniors, not high school freshmen. She gets a lot of shit, in fact. I know she's involved in a lot of religious groups, but she doesn't preach to me, so I don't care. But she's been extra quiet and introverted the past couple of weeks. She looks like she's in the zombie mode. I wish I could help her, but I can barely help myself. I wonder if all that bullying has worn her down. I can see how it would. I have to make an effort to talk to her more often. Maybe invite her to tea or a movie. Although she's an ad adult, I bet she's not allowed to watch her R-rated films. Jesus. Very like, you know. Yeah. You, 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 I wonder why. I mean, how would? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Religious yeah. and what? I guess family and stuff. Huh. Yeah. Interesting. But we're gonna find out. Oh, yeah. You're going to worry that. Shush, I'm dreaming. Then there is Victoria Chase, the lead of Blackwell Academy, and a total bitch. And I hate saying that. I just don't know why somebody who's so rich and beautiful needs to be so fucking mean. 18-year-olds at a prestigious academy should be evolving into artists and scholars, not real reality show contests contestants. Victoria does everything for maximum drama. She actually was wastes her time calling me out in class and taunting Kate Marsh. For reals, I wish her parents could see her in action. They'd cut off that trust and fun fast. Then again, she's in the Vortex Club and they seem to own the school, so maybe that's why she doesn't give a shit. Probably. The odd thing is that she does know art and photography. Oh, she can't even say all those French names that break my tongue. Her work is a little cold, but she has a good eye. She's a she also has an eye for Mr. Jefferson, which is so obvious that I'm embarrassed for her. Oh, Jesus. She does everything but sit in his lap. He keeps his distance, though. We can all tell she's trying to win the every Everyday Heroes contest. I'm sure it drives her crazy when there is somebody she can't buy or seduce. Ha! I hope. Yeah. Man. Yeah, people like that. Uh, we're done. Okay, that was a lot of backstory we're, or we're a lot done. of... Uh, How about this? Yeah. Ooh. Uh, oh, yeah, oh, sorry. That's something I think I can tell you because it's not... Okay. These are pictures you can take in the in the game oh they are sometimes secret okay so does it you know, add something to the game you get no not really okay but good. it's like yeah it's like Just something to collect special. i yeah, guess exactly. okay she had a brilliant eye so she could have wait taken you can you can pause 
because it's the first episode. <gasps> Ooh, it's the first episode. Yeah, normally 15 to 20 minutes, but we talked so much, so we're going to do It's like the first episode. Minutes. I guess the first episode is always longer, but normally 15 to 20 minutes, exactly yeah. what you said. Guys, we're going to keep playing. Definitely. Through. I love it already, even though we didn't do anything yet. No, it was a lot of backstory. I hope you can... Yeah, forgive us. Yeah, forgive us about that. Um, but maybe next episode we'll do actual shit and yeah. get shit done, you know? Yeah. Now we've read everything. We can't do anything. Anymore, yeah. So, yeah, let's go. Thank, Thank you. you guys for watching. Next time.